Hey guys, today we're going to be doing a video of how to install maps into Minecraft Pocket Edition. First, uh, yeah, this is recording. Just had to make sure I haven't used OBS in forever. Mm. Didn't mean to drag that that either. Ah, fuck me. So we're going to, um, yeah, install maps into Minecraft Pocket Edition. First, there's two things you want to download. iExplorer and the map you want to install. And that's all you need to download. And a zip opener. I have WinWire. If that's what you want to use, you can use 7-Zip or anything else that works too. So I'll have a link to both the, well really just a link to iExplorer because you can have whatever map you want. I just downloaded this map for the video, just some random parkour map. So yeah, you go to the internet and yeah, follow the link I send in the description below. So you open up iExplorer. Just wait for it to open. And I Explorer is paid for, but there's keys all over the place for it. So I need to plug. Yep. Yeah, once you open I Explorer, you need to plug your phone in after you get a registration key or just use the demo mode. I don't know if the demo mode works for, or not for what we're doing, but I. Okay, you close iTunes. You don't need iTunes. So once you have your this open and you're at this screen after you log in and everything. Uh, yeah, if you need a key, just go search one on YouTube. They're everywhere. And once you're in here, you can go to your apps. And then you can go to Minecraft PE. It probably won't be there for you since you don't do it, haven't did it yet. You just hit apps and there's all the list of all your apps. But once you're in Minecraft PE, you go to games, com.mojang, and worlds. Then here's all your worlds. These are three worlds I have right now. This one I've installed before. So you just close that. You extract your map to a folder. And here it is. This is what the extracted looks like. Just all the files. There are two files. Well, really, we're going to be using this file there. But I'm pretty sure we can just put the whole thing in to like, explore. So we just take that, take the folder put in there and it's done there we go that's all, basically all you need to know where I get my maps from uh, I just search them up on Google if you just search like I'm running version 0.2.1 of Minecraft Pocket Edition so you search, search up Minecraft PE map 0.2.1 and click on anything you want minecraftform.net is probably the most reliable place for if you don't want to get a virus but this place works too this uh, thing I downloaded didn't give me a virus so uh, that was good and so that's basically all you need to know for doing it it's really simple and then once you load up Minecraft Pocket Edition I'll load it up right here hit play or you just load it up hit play and it should be there and there you go Wait a minute. It's not working right. Okay, um, yeah, now I'm back. That was kind of a fail on my end. I didn't do something right, but now I got it to work right. So what you have to do is, you don't put the whole Candyland parkour thing in there. I can just delete this. Wait, hold on. Yeah, I can just delete this whole thing. I didn't need that. Just ignore this. Yeah, you can't delete it for some reason. But if you just go in here, you take the file that has the level data and level data old and level name in there. You take that, and then you jump it into iExplorer here, and then it works. Like I just uploaded loaded it up and I spawned in a room built with a bunch of signs. So yeah, um, that's it for this video now. I, it was for the most part of a fail because I didn't know what I was doing. This is the first time I did it in a while. So yeah, see you guys in the next video.